Well, I won. Go me. I don't have a victory speech ready, unfortunately, but I guess been there, done that comes to mind. Nonetheless, this is Racket Sports, a game that uses 50% of the name of a similar Wii game and about 100% of its gameplay. I rarely recommend a game like this, and that's not necessarily because they do anything wrong, although in this case it does, but even with nice graphics, sharp gameplay, and any host of elements that make a game decent, this is still a game without an identity of its own. This is the tennis game from Wii Sports, repeated five times over. And although this particular title is about as good as something like that could be, the problem is there's not really any reason for you to play it. There's just nothing original or even different about Racket Sports. Racket Sports is a compilation of five motion-controlled sports games. It includes tennis, beach tennis, which is apparently an altogether different thing, table tennis, badminton, and squash. You might notice all the games use a racket, which is the whole point. And once you play it, you also notice that they're all the freaking same. No matter which sport you choose, you play by swinging the remote like a tennis racket. And of course, no matter which sport you choose, the actual gameplay is indistinguishable. You're doing the same thing, just with slightly different rules. Hence the identity problem and the question, why is this even a thing? But the strange thing is, if you can look beyond the whole existential debate over racket sports, you find the game really isn't terrible. It's a perfectly decent sports game for the casual audience, at least in terms of its gameplay and presentation. The motion controls pale in comparison to the complexity afforded in Wii Sports Tennis, which made top spin and location a lot easier, but they are serviceable, which, I mean, I guess that's a compliment. The game also supports Wii Motion Plus, but it doesn't seem to make much of a difference, so with either remote, the controls feel the same. Equally average. But I guess if there's a high point to racket sports, it's the graphics. Now this isn't a showpiece for the Wii by any means, but the environments are colorful and fun to look at, perfectly decent looking, especially given the crap third parties usually put on the system. An exception, however, are the characters. You get these really generic avatars that are basically the Miis, but without any of their appeal, charm, or character. I mean, these things are just painfully generic, and although you can unlock some outfits and accessories, I doubt you'll care enough to actually experiment with them. The lack of Mii support hurts, but at the same time, if Racket Sports had Miis, the comparisons to Wii Sports would be even more obvious. In fact, they'd go from similarities to inarguable rip-offs, and that's a line this game is already very close to crossing. If you're gonna release a game that copies another game that has become synonymous with the system, at least do something different. At least build upon the ideas or the mechanics. Racket Sports just chooses not to. And as a result, this is a game that copies one game from a compilation and only manages to hit the net.